Okay, so, whoa, vehicle, watch where you're going. Um, okay, so funny little thing, I actually started recording like, I don't know, a couple minutes ago, and my game froze, and I'd only been recording for, I don't know, like 20 seconds, so I just restarted. Well, I didn't restart, I just, well, I deleted the recording file, it was really funny. I was like, this ain't working, I tried hitting guide on my Xbox, nothing, it was a big fail. But it didn't matter anyway, because I went into the wrong door, <laughs> but, I don't know. I've always had uh, freezing problems with games like that, so at any rate, I had said previously this place is starting to get pimped out. I don't know where he is. Just a minute. Let me look on the map, because they're saying these people are setting up shop. But I don't see how they are. I'm, gonna, I'm just doing a quick look around. Just take a peek, because this is the archery area. Or, the target area. What's on hey. your mind? Come Nothing really. If you need more I've already maxed out my training with you, I'm afraid. I'm afraid. Anyway. Hmm. I thought they said there was Mark. Where the hell was it? This was where all the stuff was. The big hall. He took it all. I thought there must have been so much money in there. Yeah, I guess I have it. Yes? If you want to be a master pickpocket like me, I can get you there. Should I give him this? Are you out of your mind? <laughs> Up to no good, are we? I'll teach you, but it'll cost you. No thanks. Anyway, let's just get to it. I gotta find somebody to help me with my smithing. Because that's what I want to do. I want to be able to smith some pretty cool shit. Like the dragon armor, for example. I can make that out of, uh, whatchamacallit. I can make that out of the dragon bones after I kill a dragon. So they do have use. That You don't just sell them for parts. You do have use for dragon bones. Now, we're going to white run first. Complete that there. Then make our way up to solitude and do that. So, we got to find... Falkreath. I've barely gone to Falkreath. There's been no reason so far. Like, honestly, not even the main quest is like, uh, no. There's nothing here for us. Like, maybe we'll make our way there, but as of now, nothing really. The Great Statue of Irking Thand. But after these two, I'll be done with Thieves Guild. Like, how long has it taken us to get through the entire Thieves Guild? A long time. And then, I like, there's side missions for Dark Brother, like little things on the side, you know. But, I don't know, man. We'll see. What are you all looking at? Why is everybody on this friggin' bridge? Like, do you really need to guard this bridge that much? No, you do not. Then they make me pay it. Shut up, man. Give it a break. Like, give it a rest, honestly. I hope the Empire is sending reinforcements to drive these heathens out of White Rod. You're here, and not a moment too soon. If anything should happen to Arn, there'll be hell to pay. A close friend of mine. We fought together on the battlefield for many years until old age got the better of us. Now it's up to me to save him one more time. This time, from the executioner's block in solitude. The city guard in solitude is seeking on for a serious crime. 
When he fled here, he was arrested for drunken behavior. Can you imagine? That's hilarious. His identity isn't known to the authorities in Whiterun, so there's still a chance to save him. Hold a moment. This is more than a simple prison break. I want to have Arn's name stricken from the record books permanently. I'm setting him up with a new identity. It's the only way to throw the guard permanently off his trail. The job is twofold. First, steal a letter that was sent from Solitude warning White Run's guard to be on the lookout for Arn. The second is to change Arn's name in the prison registry to his new identity. Pretty hardcore. If it was easy, I would have hired a local thug instead of a professional. You see, both nah. of these items are kept inside Dragon's Reach. And they don't allow visitors inside the Jarls or the steward's chambers. One more thing. If you get caught, I can't afford to be connected to you. Remember that before you do anything stupid. I don't even care. Let's go. I don't even talk to Ulfred Battleborn that much. The guy's a bit of a whiner. Oh, it is up at the Forge. Or Dragon's Reach. I thought it was... Oh. Okay. I thought it was like en route and you had to find it. Alright, fair enough. Is, is everything in here? No, you don't. Okay, yeah, you might know me. I'm the guy who liberated this place, you jackass. Stormcloak rule right now. But I'm just kind of wondering what would have been better, the Stormcloaks or the, the Imperials? I don't think it matters, really. I really don't. From the way I look at it, the Imperials are just like the superpowers or whatever that are currently in control. And the, and the uh, Stormcloaks are just the, the rebels, pretty simply put. Wait, now that I'm here, where's that assistant? He's never around. I don't get it. You're here. Need supplies. Let's wait about. Oh, it's still a little early. I remember Buddy's always late. Elithor at his store. Sleep. Eight. We'll do nine, ten. We'll say ten o'clock, and then I can give him the sword. That's good stuff. Here he is. Okay. Perfect. Oh, it's real. Bignar and I have our hands full. It's no. You've already purchased every available improvement. I'm afraid I have nothing else to offer you. Wait a minute, he's gone now. Wait, so how can I do that? I know you. No, you don't. Everybody knows me, it seems. Like blow me, good sir. The Jarl's quarters. Okay, I think shit can be persuaded. Hi. Damn faithless Imperials. Wait, I know you. Shit. All right then. Good. Oh, I don't want the crap. <laughs> Yarl's quarters just helped myself. <laughs> Too bad this isn't like any of the other ones. Or I would have just thrown something in there. This is a changed letter. Ledger. Alright, now where am I going? How's it going? They don't, yeah, they, they don't really have a choice. That's why this is so easy. Because I'm the one who liberated them. Let it be known that we are seeking the criminal named Arn for the crime of murder and solitude. If you should locate him, detain him, and contact me by courier. That, that was so freaking easy. I think it was meant to be a lot harder, but since I liberated them, they can't help but let me in here, you know what I mean? So, unless there's another thing he wants me to do. Oh, you know what? I probably have to break him out of prison, too. That's probably phase two. We'll see. But that could be it. For all I know, that could be all I need to do. And that'd be friggin' hilarious. 
be like a five ten minute thing tops just cruising on it man that's it hello at the same time they want me to uh, keep you know it, that one mission where I was supposed to bring that sword I couldn't I can't do it anymore because he's gone somewhere and same with his her father her father is no longer in there either so that's another glitch they should have thought of you know there's a lot of things on the, on the line whenever you do when you overthrow them like that you you can't come back to it which is really stupid Ah. Wait, I know you. No, you don't. Woo, cannonball! And you can still hear Hemsker. Heimsker. Dude, seriously, we get it. Talos is amazing. God. Like, come on. That's, that's pretty much the gist of it, is it not? I mean, you don't need to go on a... Like an hourly long rant just to tell us that you think he's pretty cool. I could tell you, I could have said the same thing. All I gotta do is say, okay. Okay, I got it. Thanks. Now, goodbye, Hemsker. What's she running around for? What are you looking at? I'm not afraid of you. No. Boys, girls, dogs, elders. There's nobody I won't fight. You're weird. That's the one who wanted the. Lars to kiss her. That was funny. I called that. I mean, I said that way before, but I totally called that. Like, that's what happens, man. It's funny. It's just the way it is. So, that's how you know. They bugged the piss right out of you, man. I hope the Empire is sending reinforcements. Arn? Never heard of him. <laughs> I guess that means you're finished. Wow, that was easy. Here's your payment. Tell Delvin. That he has my support and all the weight it carries in White Run from now on. I think he'll be quite pleased. Oh, probably. You want that was so freaking easy. Like I have, uh, dude. That was so. That was so easy. Wait a minute. What ring am I wearing? Did I just put a ring? Wait. I don't think I'm wearing a ring. I think I put it in my safe. So maybe I can. Wear that. Yeah, I haven't been. Stamina regenerates. That could come in handy. Yeah, I'm not wearing a ring. Yes, I am. It's right here. What do I want more? Destruction spells. Sneaking's better. I kind of like that. That's pretty quick. Anyway. No, wait, we're done here. Let's go to Solitude and do what we can do there. Speak to Eriker. At the Blue Palace. I'm just wondering if I, if I would have had much more success if I did go with the Imperials. I mean, so far we haven't really made that much of an indentation. Like, it's only been little things, but... At the same time, the whole, like, Skyrim is already pretty much all Imperial control. It seems like, like, yeah, okay, the Stormcloaks have, what? Stormcloaks have that one up top, right? You know, sorry, I can't remember. Wilhelm, they've already always had that one. The Imperials are good for business, and business is good for Skyrim. About time you got here. I'm not accustomed to dealing with people who are unreliable. That's why I asked Delvin to send me his best. That would be me. Huh. That remains to be seen. Nothing raises my ire more than having an agreement broken. It's bad for business, and it wastes time. Captain Volf of the Dainty Slode has decided to test my patience on this matter by neglecting to honor a trade agreement we had established. I need you to help me show him the error of his ways by sneaking on board the slowed and planting some contraband. 
You'll need to get your hands on some Belmora Blue from Sabine Niette down by the docks. She's the first mate on another ship, the Red Wave. Once you get your hands on it, I want you to plant it in Captain Volf's footlocker. I'll take care of the rest. Captain Volf is ashore right now, and I want the authorities waiting for him when he gets back. Now get going. I don't want to see your face until the job's done. Why did his voice change all of a sudden? Do you hear that? 